Hey everybody, it's nice. I hope everyone role-playing as a mage or astrologer slash sorcerer is having a nice day. Today I want to go ahead and give you the location of the meteorite staff. So here's the beginning location right here. And here's where you will want to go in order to uh, get an S-tier staff very early. This is the meteorite staff. I recommend putting a beacon at the location I have here on the map as it'll highlight it like so. After that, uh, you want to get on your mount if you have that unlocked already. And you want to go straight to that. Um, this area will have a couple of enemies in it. Uh, none of them at all are tough to take out, just standard enemies and a couple of dogs. Um, you can get an easy backstab on the first guy in the area, and then the rest of them are pretty defenseless, basically. So you're just going to take them out, uh, watch out for the dogs, they're the only thing that can really damage you. Uh, this is a tutorial designed to do very early in the game, so you should be able to do it. Um, it gives you access to a very good staff very early on. So you're going to come down to these tunnels. There will be a lot of uh, very uh, New York-esque <laughs> sewer rats down here. Um, you can sneak past them. Uh, I'm not sure if the Confessor's Assassin's Approach is necessary to sneak by. Um, I already did this on my Astrologer and I just decided to kill them, but yeah. Uh, you can sneak by or kill them. They're very easy. Um, after that, you come to the door and there will be a chest here. Well, what happens next is it's actually not in this chest. This chest is actually a trap which will teleport you to a very far side of the map and that's where you're gonna go for the next area. Now in this next area I will say the enemies are very difficult. When you first spawn in you'll be here in the Celia Crystal Tunnel. Uh, there is a easy box to loot to your left. I recommend taking that. There will be a guard patrolling. You can actually ignore every ad in this area. Don't make the mistake I made on my first playthrough. Um, so once that ad patrols and goes by, you can then just sneak by. I highly recommend not bothering anyone as there are very... I, I, I like to just refer to them as snipers. I'll actually zoom in uh, right here so you can see those guys right there. They have a very strong ranged ability that will almost one-shot you early game. So uh, you come here. Uh, there will be a, uh, a site to rest at, a uh, gray site, so you want to rest here. Um, after you spend your attribute points, whatever you want to do, you want to come out here. Uh, it, I highly recommend having the mount. Uh, if you don't have the mount, I would come back and uh, do this later, but you'll be at the swamp. As soon as you come in, come to your far right. Uh, far right, just keep riding this coastline as you see me do uh, towards the southwest. So keep coming, keep coming. You're going to see a structure that looks like this. You're going to be at the Street of Sages Ruins. Once you reach here, um, just go forward. You just pretty much picture it as you're going to the back right corner or the northeast corner, um, so to speak, from your positioning. You're going to come here. There's going to be a couple of poisonous flowers in the rooms where you need to get the staff, but you can just go outside and uh, get it this way. Um, I recommend just getting off the mount, obviously, to get it. Uh, then you want to hug the wall like this and it's that simple now you have the meteorite staff very very good staff um, I highly think this is worth getting in the early game before you even go out adventuring it's very easy and as you can tell you don't have to engage with anything uh, above your level what makes the staff so great is its S tier it scales with your intelligence as you can see, it scales off of intelligence in the S tier, which is really good, especially for an early game weapon. You do have to be 18 intelligence, so just put two more into Astrologer as soon as you start, or just get to 18 no matter what character you choose. Yeah. 